what's up guys, in this episode I'm going to show you how to use strings. I'm going to give you a quick overview in Java because they are used so much. Well, I say a quick overview because it's not um, a primitive data type that we learned about last episode, but we'll learn much more about them later on, so I'm going to just do it quickly. You know. So what is a string? A string is a sequence of characters that we just uh, that we just learned in the last episode, basically, like basically a, a bunch of chars added up. So let's go ahead and make one, but first we need to make a new project. So we'll open up IntelliJ. Okay guys, so we got it started up. So we're gonna go to File, New, Project. And uh, we'll skip right ahead. And then we'll use the template here. So we're gonna name this one Strings. And it's gonna have its own folder, that's good. And good package, all right. I'm gonna turn this on so I don't have to keep clicking this window. And yeah, so we can start coding now. So. Let's go ahead and make a string. Um, it's really, really, really simple. But you have to remember, um, this is not a primitive data type, so you have to use, it's basically a class, so you have to use a capital S when you're declaring a string. So string um, dog equals Jerry. Dog's name is Jerry. So yeah, so it's just a collection of letters together, or sentences, whatever you want to have. So Jerry, and then we can have you know sentences, like I said, so oops, string. Uh, declaration of independence equals I am free, bruh. What? Don't freeze. I am free, bruh. Okay. So, oops, that's Fortnite. Okay. Um, so we can print these out individually. So we can do sout Jerry. Oh, dog. Not Jerry, dog. They can sout this one out too. So sout declaration of independence so let's see what we get so if we did it right we should get jerry and then i am free bro on the next line awesome so we get exactly that so let's try um there's something we can do basically um like we're going to learn about soon in the next few episodes we can learn about operations where um we could add integers like one plus one or one divided by one just stuff like that so we can also do that with strings so let's do that really quick so string uh, multiple equals we could do dog plus declaration of independence and then we get sout multiple so it's just going to add them together however they are so jerry and then no space i'm a free bra so we'll see come on there it is so jerry i am free bra so it just adds them together um there's no space here because we didn't add a space so we could just put a space here if you want to And if not, if we don't want to do all that, we could just uh, do something called a concatenation, which we'll probably learn about more later on also. So dog plus, and this is this is something I've been doing in the last few episodes also. So now I'll cover it right here. So concatenation is when you add multiple strings together, basically. And then you could add uh, basically strings that are declared inside of the, out, the print line. It's hard to explain, but yeah. So this will create a space. You just uh, make sure you have a plus between each uh, String basically, this is basically a string itself. It's just not assigned to a variable. So now we have Jerry, I'm free, brah. And uh, yeah, we could say, um, we could add something else on there. So Jerry, I am free, brah. Because, oops, I am cool. So we can add that on there. We make sure you have the plus, right? Plus between strings. So we add that on there. And then we get Jerry, I'm free, brah, because I am cool. I'm not sure if that's proper grammar, if we need a comma there or not. But anyway, you get the point, hopefully. Um, so we have space there if you want it. I mean, so that's that. I mean, it's pretty simple. Just a bunch of words added together. And um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this little episode on how to use uh, strings in Java. So leave a like if you liked it. If you have any questions, just leave a comment and I'll get right to you and help you. And uh, if you want to see more, make sure you subscribe and I'll be dropping a ton of Java videos because I like this language. So peace. If you want to see anything, let me know also in the comments and bye.